Alan, I know you feel Bayer. that. Good flick. Hunter clears. Neil. Why Mark had given up. Kennedy won that well from Talbot. Got Keegan outside him on his left. Four men on his right. Delayed too long. Hunter's tackle was not fair. Cooper satisfied that that post is covered. And Keegan blasts the shot, and it's in! A really fine free kick by Kevin Keegan, but Paul Cooper will blame himself for it. He had the other post covered, and so he knew that if the ball was coming, that's the way it would come. Keegan ran, hit it, bent it round the wall, and as Cooper went down, got his arms to the ball, but could only push it onto the post. Smith, Beatty, Mills, Gates. Highway, Keegan on his left. Just tucked through, nodded back by Kennedy. Osborne. Obstructed by Smith. Beatty hoisting the free kick a long way downfield where Hughes meets it. Callaghan getting it out to safety. David Johnson waiting for the throw. Good turn by Gates. And a head back and in by Weimark. It really was a beautiful cross. The throw in by Johnson. Gates a good turn onto the line, and when he clipped it across, Clements went after it, and you could see the consternation on his face as he realised he wasn't going to make it, and Weimark just had an easy job to nod it back in. Trevor Weimark with eight goals, Ipswich's leading scorer this season. And a well-made and well-taken goal by Ipswich. Only the second goal that Ray Clements has conceded in seven and a half games, very nearly. Kennedy. Kennedy, a good shot, and there was a deflection there. Cooper did well to cover that from Kennedy's left foot. A slight deflection, and Cooper down with his body behind the ball. Neil, very cleverly recovering his balance. Burley. Toshak. Neil. Callaghan. Smith. Keegan going in. Nothing wrong with that one. The deep cross from Tommy Smith. Finding Kevin Keegan's head as it so often has in the past and Keegan's header like a bullet just inside the far post. Back header by Mills. BT. Mills. Worked like a Trojan, the Ipswich skipper. 
Hughes, not yet clear. Burley, chased by Keegan. Osborne now. It's Neil there with him. Still gets in his cross, Gates! Good goal! Bobby Robson's decision to bring Osborne and Gates into the side amply fulfilled. A fine bit of football there. Slipped through by Burley to Osborne. Osborne controlled it well, played the cross, and Gates took his time to balance himself and strike a very good goal indeed past Clements. His second goal of the season, tying up the score at two all. Mills with the free kick for Ipswich. Beatty. Good header away by Hughes. Callaghan. Smith. Keegan. Toshak. Highway. Looking for a chance to get into the area. In the end, his pass hits Gates, and Ipswich are on the break. Too hard for Weimark, who had a lot of open space ahead of him. Neil's throw. The urgency clearly appreciated by Liverpool. It's so much bunching at the top of the first division. They can't afford to drop home points. Keegan. Chance to shoot, and again! Jimmy Case, the answer to Liverpool's prayer. He got through a few times from that angle. That time he steadied himself deliberately, hit it hard. Cooper got his body behind it but couldn't hold it, and when it came back, Case made no mistake, his ninth goal of the season. Liverpool now leading 3 to 2 and 12 minutes to go. BT Johnson Mills. Gates is going to drop back to allow Woods to go front, go up front. Here is Clive Woods. Mills. Hunter. Well met by Weimark with his head. Callaghan, Kennedy. Dangerous kicking by Johnson. Well, it's given the other way. Burley to take the kick. by BT, Weimark is here, well saved, and it's gone in! Weimark followed it in and makes it 3 all. When the kick came over from Burley, it came through eventually to Weimark, and as he bore in for the shot, Clements was out making a magnificent save at his feet, but from the rebound, Weimark followed it through and it just seemed to trickle inside the post. That was a great result for them, 3-3 there at Liverpool. There were a lot of young, young, fresh players.